Before we get into this video, please subscribe to my channel, click the bell notification button and please like this video as well. Hey everybody, welcome back to my YouTube channel. As you guys have seen by the title, today I am doing an Ikea haul, Primark, Topshop and Poundland because I did go to Ikea today. So basically I'm filming this haul on the day that I actually went to Ikea and Primark and everything. Honestly, I love Ikea and obviously I Ikea and all the shopping centres and shops have been closed for a while so I was so happy to go back to Ikea especially because Ikea is such a great place and all their furniture and everything in there is amazing and so affordable and obviously um, I did go into the Metro Centre as well which is a shopping centre in Gateshead, Newcastle and I did spend quite a bit of money so I thought that I would do a haul for you guys because shopping hauls are my favourite type of videos and I do love showing you guys what I bought from the shops and everything so that you guys can go and buy them yourself because literally I love spending my money and showing you guys what I bought but without further ado let's go on the video. So firstly from Ikea like I love Ikea so much like all their like fake flowers, candles, home stuff, everything, the furniture I like I'm obsessed with Ikea but anyway the first thing I bought was some fake flowers like a lovely bunch of pink flowers with like some little like plants coming out of them and um, this is called SMY CKA so Smica, Smica and I love these flowers um, like a lot fake flowers are so lovely to have like in your house and everything and like I did also buy like a little bit like a little vase for it um, so this is pretty cute. Like, and these flowers were like two pounds. Like, and the vase was actually like, one seventy five, I think. Like, and this is really cute. And the reason why I did buy a lot of home like items was because I have not updated my room in ages, and like it's well overdue, like an update. So like I did buy these to update my room a little bit. I have this really cool like candle kind of holder things. This is called. Oh, uh, what is this actually called? Basically, this cool kind of like. Um, like candle kind of holder thing like you can put um, like fake plants in this I do really love gold um, like homeware so that's why like I bought this um, like because it look really cool with like some fake plants in it like even fairy lights or something and like and it was £8 as well so pretty good price so, like it's also um, handmade as well which I think is really cool but for £8 like it was really cool and like a candle like a fairy light to this will look really cute so yeah like it's gold as well which i really love as well so yeah i got that as well so basically this is like a hanging rose vine so basically like you put this on your shelf and like it'll hand down basically i did buy this for nine pounds i think so like i was really pushing the boat out does this have a name this is called the fijka like and i actually bought a little plant pot for it. Day day. Sorry guys, my SD card was full, but talking about what my plant pot wasn't that. So basically, this vine will look really cute, like on my shelf. The plant pot is really cute, and I do actually own a few of these. And the gold colour, like, it looks really nice in my room. Because my room is nice and pink, and it was actually only 175 I think. So pretty good price. And um, yes, yeah, so, so these look really cute together. And, um, like, it'll look really cute with, like, some fairy lights. Um, like in between the vines and everything which I thought would be a good idea on my shelf because obviously I, because I wanted to buy a few a few new homeware things to actually because uh, basically I want to buy a, new, a few new homeware items to change my room a bit because I haven't had like a room update in a while so that's the reason why I went to Ikea and had a bit of a splurge on these flowers and these flowers were £9 so I was pushing the boat out a little bit but it's fine I love them and they will look absolutely stunning on my shelf. So next up from Ikea, I actually did buy a few candles because if you guys have been to Ikea before, you'll know how lovely and so cheap the candles are. So I'll just get the candles up because honestly, these candles are unreal. Firstly, I got the um, original vanilla one. Honestly, the vanilla candle is gorgeous and this is like this is like the larger one so like it has got 40 hours of burning time I, I, ha I do actually own a few of these but the smaller versions and they are lovely candles and literally, literally and they literally do like fill your room with the smell of like the scent on and the vanilla one smells beautiful so this is like two pounds odd I think 
and honestly it's a bargain honestly if you guys have never been to Ikea you are missing out big time because all their like home stuff and like the candles and everything are so good and they are really cheap and affordable so the first one I got was like a vanilla ice cream one and honestly I'll I love this scent from Ikea. I've literally had so many of these candles, but this one is one of the best scents from Ikea. Um, so next up, I actually bought a large peach um, candle as well. Um, this has got 40 hours of burning time. I smelt this. I fell in love straight away. Honestly, it smells so sweetly of peaches and it smells unreal. And this will smell absolutely unreal. And like I'll probably put it like on my shelf because it's so nice and it smells unreal. Um, so yes, I, I love the smell of peaches. And the final item from Ikea, like I did buy this Valdoft um, candle. It actually smells of berries and it's really nice. And it also has 25 hours of burning time. And I really do love the um, glass um, container that it's in because it's really cute. And it's so nice. Um, so yes, that is what like I bought from Ikea. So moving on to Topshop, I actually bought a pair of Jamie jeans and they are unreal. I actually needed a new pair of jeans. Like, and I do have like a pair of Topshop Johnny jeans. Like, and I've had them for like a few years and the quality of them is amazing. It's like, I thought that I would push the boat out and buy some Topshop jeans again. So these are the Topshop, these are the Topshop Johnny, Johnny jeans, I mean the Jamie jeans. These are in a size eight. These have like some rips in them and everything. Like, and they're really nice. And these were actually £30 because it's like they do have like a slight um, like rip in the back, but um, like, like I don't mind that. Um, but yes, yeah, so like I bought the jeans to wear and they went and they went straight in my basket because I like I love them a lot and they're really nice. So that is what I bought from Topshop. So moving on to Primark, honestly, Primark at the minute they have so much like amazing stuff. And I can't wait to show you guys because I literally am obsessed with Primark, like Primark and everything. It's just so good. So I can't wait to show you what I bought from Primark because I'm honestly so excited. So next up is Primark. And if you guys know me, I do love Primark a lot. Like Primark is such a great place to shop. So where do I start with? I actually bought a pair of Sosu eyelashes in Holly. I have had these eyelashes before and they're lovely. And I... I I did need to get a new pair of eyelashes and I do love the saucy ones and for £5 you wear them up to 20 times and they're really affordable and I literally every time I'm in and literally every time I am in Primark I will 100% buy some saucy eyelashes because they are lovely and and they look really pretty on uh, I can't speak today and they look really pretty on your eyes as well so I can't wait to wear these because I do love so two eyelashes and I can't believe they actually sell them in Primark for £5 as well. £5 for eyelashes is so cheap because sometimes some pairs of eyelashes can be like over £10 which I think is ridiculous. But yeah, I do love I do love these a lot and I will wear them. Talking on, on the kind of beauty side of things in Primark, if you, if you guys have ever been to Primark, you will know that they literally have a whole wall or area of fake nails. And obviously the Primark fake nails, if you've tried them, they are amazing. So, like, like I did buy these two pairs of Square Lotto gloss nails. So first ones was I bought them in flame. So it's like a lovely red colour. I, I literally, I love red fake nails and I love them so much. So I got a red pair and for a pound they are a bargain. So I got a red pair and I also got a lilac pair because like la lilac and lavender is really in at the minute. And like I did buy a lavender bodysuit and this will look really cute with these nails because they literally are the same colour so yeah I'm now all stocked up on nails from Primark honestly if you guys have never tried them you need to try them because they literally are like the same as acrylics but you just glue them on yourself with, with nail glue and they're really easy to apply and everything so that's what I got from Primark as well so that's like the beauty items so next up I bought two pairs of sunglasses two pairs I know, but um, but basically, like I do have two pairs of sunglasses at home at the minute, but they're both broken and I've had them for a few years, and I thought it was time to get some new pairs of sunglasses. So, firstly, like I bought this black pair. These are unreal, and I mean, like they were three pounds as well. So I'll just try them on for you guys and show what I mean. I am 
I'm obsessed with these sunglasses, they are so nice and also I fit my small face really well and I really like them. Um, and then like I also bought a pink pair as well because I love pink and I do love pink sunglasses so like I bought like a pair of these as well and these are gorgeous sunglasses to wear as well like and I'm actually going to Portugal in July so I'll be wearing these on the beach in Carlisle maybe like if it's like warm and they're really cute it's done for three pounds they are an absolute bargain so that is why I bought two pairs because you can never go wrong with Primark sunglasses honestly they are unreal and I love them so much so that's why I bought two pairs because I am obsessed with sunglasses and they literally are so cool as well like I literally love these and I will get a lot of use out of them this summer I hope, hope, fingers crossed it will be sunny and warm in the UK because if it's not then it'll be sad and we'll be indoors all the time but fingers crossed it'll be nice and sunny because I'll be able to wear these and I can't wait from holiday as well I'm super excited to wear them on holiday. Woo! So next to in Primark, I did buy uh, like a free pack of like the one pound um, like like underwear bits. So this pair like a red, a pink, and a grey, and like a white pair as well, which are really nice. And like honestly, Primark thongs and everything like that, they are so good and they literally last for ages. And a pound per pair is an absolute bargain. And literally, I wear them a lot and they're really good so Primark underwear is always a win so next up like I bought um, a three pack of scrunchies um, these are what are these again velvet cord ones like a baby pink kind of like a limey uh, yellow colour and a baby blue and these were 150 and these are so beautiful like I literally wear these in my hair all the time I can't wait to wear them they are so cute and basically 50p Per scrunchie, which is an absolute bargain, like it literally, it's unbelievable, isn't it? So, that is what I also bought. And the final thing from Primark, which is really boring, like some new socks, these are the Arch Support Trainer Liner um, socks. I really needed some new socks because literally all of mine have holes in them. I've literally had to throw out tons of socks because literally they had holes in them. So, like, I bought five pairs of these socks. Um, for 250 so they went straight in my basket and um, was so next up like i just bought some items from poundland um because poundland is such a great shop like honestly at the minute poundland have so many good bargains um like i do know that um but, like most of the items are pounds sometimes they can be two pounds or five pounds but honestly Pri primark poundland have the best bargains so first up where literally everything's just scattered on my bed so I'm sorry that I keep on going after every shop but literally everything's just all over the place so I apologise for that. Actually from Poundland I did buy another pair of eyelashes literally I saw these and these eyelashes kind of dramatic but they were a pound and they are by the brand Sparkle and Shine and they actually come with some glue as well which I didn't even realise but literally like you need to have a look in Poundland for eyelashes because they actually do have like some really nice pairs in there and he, even though these eyelashes are quite out there they are nice and they will look nice if you're going to like a party a night out and for a pound with glue like literally it, it is cheaper than Primark eyelashes so I can't wait to try them out and yeah for a pound I was like why not like you only live once I can try them out and if, if I don't like them then I'll tell you guys not to buy them do you know what I mean and then my final item for this haul because I love gold at the minute literally literally I'm gonna have a gold room after this I did buy this 8x10 gold f photo frame to put a photo because I love gold and I was actually in need of a photo frame and it was a pound so who could say no to a one pound photo frame uh, not me and it's gold as well and if, if you know me at the minute I'm literally into my gold home stuff so yes yeah, so, so this is the final item that I bought in this haul and I love it so so guys this is the end of my haul video I really hope that you guys have enjoyed this video and honestly I can't believe everything that I bought I literally love spending my money and honestly Ikea was the best shop to go in because like they literally had like all the new furniture bits like 
all the new homeware and everything and it was just overall an, an amazing experience to go back to Ikea but I really hope that you guys have enjoyed if you did you know what to do make sure to leave a thumbs up comment down below and please also subscribe to my channel as well and I will see you all in my next video bye everybody